my name is Teresa and this is my husband Cam wishing you a very happy Thanksgiving from Walt Disney World Animal Kingdom today. Yeah, I'm here for the one day only Thanksgiving feast. We're actually doing both. We're gonna do the lunch and the dinner, so two for one special. All right, everybody, we're here at our first uh, Thanksgiving uh, meal, which is lunch at the Satouli uh, Canteen. I have turkey, sweet potato hash, some pretty cool stuffing, but most importantly, I have a pumpkin cheesecake. That's right, it's not done. More pumpkin, more cheesecake. Could be the last day for it, but I got it. Um, we also have dinner set up. So this is the Avatar Land Satuli Canteen is uh, set inside of the world of Pandora, which is uh, pretty unique as you can see around here. It's very nicely themed. Sweet potato ham. Little, little boba balls that have citrus flavor. Surprisingly goes well. And uh, of course, some nice lean turkey. Great Thanksgiving lunch, getting me ready for a Thanksgiving dinner. So we're walking around, trying to kill some time before dinner, and we're just trying to catch a buzz, right? We're looking around to see where we can get some of the good stuff. And before you know it, there's a little sign beacon. We've never seen it before. A lounge up the stairs to the left, or if you read the sign from the other side to the right. Long story made short, we've never seen this before. As you can see, it's fairly empty in here, so not many people know. But there is now a new secret place to catch a buzz in Animal Kingdom, hidden right inside of the restaurant of Saurus Lounge. The back end of where they serve the food to the regular folk, we're here getting the high test. Now we gotta go to dinner. Be the driest soup you've ever had. But uh, we've got uh, pistachios that are spiced with a chai liqueur called Sumras, a pear ginger chutney, and a pickled jalapeno slice. And then we just pour the soup over that here at the table to kind of try to mix that up so you get some different textures and flavors in each bite. Oh, yeah. Can you tell me what was in the bread again? Because mm -hmm, I sure. cannot remember what yeah. it was. Yeah, they, uh, it's a Moroccan spice blend called Ras El Khanout. And uh, you've got a glaze on top of caraway seeds, flax seeds, and a pomegranate molasses from Lebanon. Wow, thank you. You're welcome, enjoy. Look how adorable this is. We have the turkey. We have a little sweet potato with some marshmallow on top. We have green bean casserole. We have little cranberry jellies. 
with some orange, some mushrooms, and of course potatoes. So good. I love and it. You got chocolate ganache icing on the sides. Underneath is a strawberry mango sauce. And then the orange is the caramel mousse with the cookies and cream mousse center. We've got a brownie for the base. And then uh, chantilly cream on top with candied crushed pistachios and blueberries and strawberries. And then for this guy, basically that apple is the cheesecake. And it has an apple pie filling in the center of it with St. Germain liqueur cooked in, or mixed in rather. The uh, little balls of apples are compressed apples, compressed with that liqueur. And then you've got a cranberry sauce underneath and the uh, white chocolate streusel going around. Wow. Enjoy. Amazing. Thank you. Thank you. Well, that's a wrap. Another great Thanksgiving. Let's move over here in the light. <laughs> you know why this was great? Because we ate everything, we drank everything, and we didn't cook a damn thing. It was the best. Food tastes better when you don't have to make it. And we know that. And uh, that's it. I think uh, this has been a pretty full day. You've been with us all day, almost. We trimmed out all the cool stuff and just left you with little bits and pieces like this. So happy Thanksgiving and uh, we'll see you next week. And be sure to like and subscribe if you want to catch more unique items like this. Yeah, if you want to catch a buzz, you have to like the video. <laughs> Bye guys.